In this video, we're going to demonstrate how to perform the thoracic outlet study. The patient is going to be seated for this examination, and we're going to take the PPG sensors and place them on the patient's fingertips with the palms facing up. You can use the index or the middle finger for this. The next step is we're going to adjust the gain on the screen to make sure the waveform fits, and then we're going to wait until we see consistent waveforms and press the capture button, and then press next. The next maneuver is called the AdSense right. Ask the patient to take a deep breath and turn their head as far right as they can while holding their breath. When the on-screen waveforms are consistent, press the capture button. Scroll the waveforms so that you have good visible waveforms on the screen and press next. The next position is the AdSense left maneuver. Ask the patient to take a deep breath and turn their head as far left as they can and hold. Observe the on-screen waveforms and when they're consistent, press capture. If you see them getting smaller as the patient is doing the maneuver, wait until they become consistent. When we press next, we'll bring up the next maneuver which is called the costoclavicular or military position. Ask your patient to take a deep breath, try and bring their chin to their chest, and touch their elbows behind their back. Again, observe the on-screen waveforms. If they're getting smaller, wait for them to settle down and then capture. The next position is called hyperabduction A. Ask your patient to take their arms, put them straight out with the palms facing the ground. Observe the on-screen waveforms. Again, wait for them to settle down and when they stop getting bigger or smaller, then press the capture button. The next position is hyperabduction B. Ask your patient to put their arms straight toward the ceiling with the palms facing forward. I'm going to wait for the waveforms to become consistent. They're getting smaller on the right side. There are a number of other positions that can be employed. These are several of the most common maneuvers. If you have maneuvers that you like that are different than these, contact your genetics representative and they can program this to have your positions in this study.